in the past two years, we've lost over 19 players to graduation, um, which has been going to be tough this year. We have about nine girls returning, um, four seniors, two juniors, and four sophomores. Um, so we'll have a really young team again um, this year. We don't have a very big junior class, that's it. There's just two of them. So we'll be looking to pull um, a lot of sophomores up and even looking at the freshmen again this year for potentials if anybody really stands out. And in an early practice like this, or early practices like this, what do you look for as a coach? Um, we really just look for the girls who come back in with the energy. They're looking to do everything that we ask for them. They're keeping up with the fast pace. You know, when we tell them to do something, it's done. And they're really that effort, um, especially on the first day. You know, we have about 50 girls trying out, and close to 20 of them are brand new kids that we don't know. You know, coming up from the middle schools, or we don't know well yet. Um, so really just for those kids who, who stand out, who can hang with some of the older kids, who pick up the drills a little bit quicker um, that we're working on than, than the others. And then we can start looking at them you know, in gameplay as the week goes on. Who are some of the players you have returning that are in key positions, skill positions? Oh, we have our goalie, Sarah McGowan, coming back. Um, she's been on varsity. This will be her third year, two years starting goalkeeper. Um, we have Haley Pregnall coming back. Um, she's been the center of my defense. Um, Maya Renya has been one of my key defenders. Um, and Danny Hetty um, joined our program a little bit late, but has really um, just improved so much over the past year. We had a really strong JV team last year and I think a lot of them are ready to be on varsity. Um, we're going to have a young team, but that's okay. I really think we can do well this season.